Hi, my name is Larry Newman. I'm an attorney. Today I'd like to tell you about the three things a doctor has to testify to for your New York personal injury case. Now before becoming an attorney, I was a chiropractor. I practiced for about 10 years and I testified and I was deposed and I was an expert witness on many personal injury cases. So I can tell you what the three things are and the three things are actually bridges that have to be crossed. These are the links or the connections that have to be made. The first link that is vital to your personal injury case is what's called the causation link. That this accident, car accident, trucking accident, slip fall or anything else, caused these injuries to your body. It's the first bridge that must be crossed. And the doctor has to testify that he or she believes to a reasonable degree of medical certainty that that's what happened, that this accident caused this injury. Second bridge or second link connection that has to be made is that all of the care that you received was appropriate, was reasonable, was necessary. And that is also needs to be testified to, to a reasonable degree of medical certainty that all the care, the MRIs, the NCVs, the testing, the physical therapy, the surgery, anything else was appropriate. Second link. Third link is that because of this accident, now you have a serious injury or you have a permanency or you have a non-permanent injury, but it debilitated you substantially for a specific period of time. And a doctor has to testify to that as well for you to cross over what's called a serious injury threshold, that the injuries that you received because of this accident were in fact serious. And the doctor needs to make those three bridges for you in order for you to make a claim for what's called a non-economic or the pain and suffering damages in New York State. If you have any questions about your New York State personal injury, you can either give me a call or you can shoot me an email. I'd love to answer your questions. Thank you.